After realizing that Song Jie is the one who saved her before, the next morning, Im Seoul meets Song Jie on the way to school. She tells him that she was planning on going to school with him because she has something to do with him. Song Jie then asks her, what's that? But Im Seoul is planning not to tell Song Jie about her plan. She then suddenly thanks Song Jie, thanking him for saving her life and apologizing to him at the same time. She tells him that she should have said thank you earlier, but she was too late. However, Song Jie tells Im Seoul that she already thanked him yesterday. For Im Seoul, thanking him today is for what Song Jie had done in the future, which is saving her. Im Seoul then realizes that Song Jie is not avoiding her anymore and mentions how Song Jie mentioned earlier that he couldn't be friends with girls. Song Jie then quickly replies to her, who's going to be friends with you? Listening to that leads Im Seoul to think that the dating rumors about Song Jie in the future, which were explained as being friends, must have been lie. And it leads her to think that Song Jie has been in a lot of relationships. Im Seoul then tells Song Jie that since he is her lifesaver, she will be a magpie who returns kindness. Confused, Song Jie corrects her by questioning her, you mean a swallow? So their conversation refers to the Korean folktale of Hoong Boo and Nol Boo. While walking and seeing a motorbike coming towards them, Im Seoul quickly pulls Song Jie to protect her from the puddle. She then mentions how the situation is almost dangerous. She then coolly tells Song Jie, then shall I be the swallow? From there, Song Jie will be flustered as he should be the one to protect her. And since Im Yok knows how Song Jie really likes Im Seoul, she decides to tell Song Jie about the real reason why Tae Song is dating Im Seoul. This will lead to the rivalry between Song Jie and Tae Song, which makes them angry at each other. Stay tuned for the next episode to witness how Im Seoul becomes the swallow who returns the kindness for Song Jie, as the Beijing Olympic 2008 is coming, and Im Seoul is planning to distract Song Jie by going out together. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.